Alright, we're we're in the Mount Mount Gulug. Zidane, that's Aiko, Kujo and the Black Mages are there too. Aiko, that must be the extraction spell. Oh no. Eilon of eternal life. Eilon of infinite thrills. Arise from thy eternal slumber. Let there be light. Let there be life. Oh no. Time has come. The time is now. Sorry, I don't have time to read both of their lines. They're like simultaneously. We need to, uh... Wait, dagger! I don't know how you feel, Dagger, so leave this to us, okay? Come on, let's do it. That was odd. Odd that was. We failed again. Again we have failed. Did you make some mistake? Make mistake I did not. Yours the mistake must be. I made no mistake at all. The truth do you speak? Of course I speak the truth. Well you two just shut up. It's his fault. His fault it is. The one who messed up is you. You're the one who messed up. I said shut up. I don't want to hear excuses. I says power from within her. Continue the extraction. Continuing further will endanger the subject's life, which I'm sure Kuja cares so much about. Only at the age of 16 can Eidolons be extracted. Ah! You two just don't get it. I need Eidolon more powerful than Alexander. Not allowed with the power to bury Garland. His powers are so incredible I cannot even come close. I must destroy him before Terra's plan is activated or my soul will no longer be my own. Who cares if she lives? I want that Eidolon. Koopo! Where did that come from? You, get out of our way. Master, Master, Koopo. Well? Her pack Moogle is interfering with the extraction process. Certain are we that it caused the failure. Kill the runt, we're running out of time. Koopo, Mog. No, Mog, hide behind me. Mog, what is it? Aiko, thank you for everything. Mog, what are you saying? Don't worry, Koopo. I will always be with you, Koopo. Mog! This way? Whoa! We'll put you to death. Put you to death, we will! Aiko, use Terra Homing, Koopo. Okay. to be by your side, Aiko. So I became Mog. Don't worry. I'll always watch over you, Koopo. Mm -hmm. 
I go, are you okay? I'm alright. Mog saved me. I never knew that Mog was an Eidolon. She always looked after me, disguised as a Moogle. Even though, even though she was weak. She fought her best to protect me. So that's what happened. Mog's ribbon. Mog. Oh, dang! It's alright, Aiko. Mog will always watch over you. You're right. How can that? That Moogle went into a trance? Kuja? Kuja! So, an eruption of anger against one's surroundings induces a complete trance. It's not the will nor the desire to nor is it the desire to protect another. Man, you're really going off. Hello. That means I simply need a powerful soul, even if that soul is not my own. No, wait. And it can be found there. <laughs> Puja, what are you plotting? I am done with you. Wait a minute. Vivi, look out. Don't worry, I hear these twins put on quite a good show. Of course, they're really not twins at all. Wait, what about the black mages? No, Vivi, it's too dangerous. Whoa. Zidane, something's wrong. I thought we defeated them. Oh, no. Stupid, I should have just. I think we increase our magic defense with Carbuncle. Oh, we can still steal. Cool. We got a gold hairpin. I think that's a pretty valuable item. Oh, we have Reflect on now, so we can't. Vaccine. We must have got the um, valuable item. Now you're all carrying a virus too. I think Carbuncle might have protected it. It protected us. I guess we can steal vaccines. Oh, we 
we do have... Okay, we do have virus. So we have, um... She does regen as a as a battle ability, so vaccine to Ico. I think we need that to supposed to vaccinate before though. That's the funny thing. No, we're, she's losing MP now. Antidote to Ico. Terrestrial Rage. I did use Phoenix on it, I think. We'll use it now. Functions also as a life spell if we ever need it. Ridiculous. There we go. 
You dead. It, the twins dead. One, two, uh. Oh. And we get another vaccine. Vivi, where's Kuja? Did he get away? Vivi? Everyone knew he was lying, but they still followed him. He said that our lifespans can't be extended, that we were fools for believing him. <coughs> Kuja said that? Uh, I'm so sorry for all I've done. You guys don't have to apologize. Where are the others? They were so shocked to hear it, they're all sitting down over there. Zidane, what am I supposed to tell them? BB. <coughs> hey BB, where are you going? All I can do is just sit with them. That bastard, why get my hands on him? Pardon me, but is someone there? What? Who might you be? Where has that Kuja gone? Oh, him. He's split, lady. What? You chased him away? I know not who you are, but you have my sincere gratitude. Could this be Princess Garnett? Why, it is! It is you! Oh, how long has it been? How long it has been? I haven't seen your highness for ages. Why, look how you've grown. So whatever brought you to this dreadful place? Who is this lady? What's a friend of yours doing here anyway? Oh my darling, Hilda, I finally found you. My darling, Ribbit, I finally found you, Ribbit. He cheated on that, by the way. I do not remember ever burying a toad. It's me, the Ribbit Sid. Of course, that mustache. It really is you. Hilda, come back to the castle, Ribbit, and return to me to my former self, Ribbit. Dreadfully sorry, my sugar cup, but I surrendered your favorite airship to a man named Kuja. Forget about it, Ribbit, as long as you're alright, Ribbit. Oh, my sweet froggy woggy. So, uh, you know Kuja? I want to make him pay. Please tell me all about him. Very well, my dear. I shall tell you everything once we reach Limblum. Ribbit, Kuja didn't touch you, did he? His soul was filled with hate, but he was polite to me. He just talked an awful lot. What about Ribbit? What about? Well, he divulged his master plan to me. I didn't even have to ask. It was tiresome. But what he spoke of, it was truly a scene from a nightmare. What did he say? That he was not of this world. He said his aim was to use this world to acquire an even more destructive power. The taking of Hildegard I was part of the, this process. He was told to Zidane about this. Ruth, do you have valuable information? Which lead me to believe that my abduction wasn't part of his plan. He was a hopeless narcissist, but... At least he wasn't a skirt chaser like you. <laughs> oh, you just hit me where it hurts most. Ruben, I'm sorry about that. That's why I risked my life to rescue you. Oh, really? Are you sure you weren't there to take back Hildegard 1? I'm not lying, Ruben. I apologize. So please, turn me back, Ribbit. I'm sick of being an oglop or a frog. I'll never cheat on you ever again, Ribbit. I promise. Can your words be trusted? No, they cannot. I don't lie, Ribbit. I swear on my father's name. All right, I'll turn you back. But it's going to be much worse if you ever cheat on me again. I... I understand. Now turn me back! Maybe I'll turn you into a hedgehog pie. <laughs> Please no, Ribbit. Now turn me back. Alright, alright.
Finally, Ribbit, I'm human again. What? I can concentrate on building Hildegard 3. Darn it. I must stop that. Dear. I'm sorry about everything, Hilda. Zidane. Hmm, Dagger? Mr. Zidane. Why are you calling me Mr. Zidane? Mr. Zidane, please get up. Oh, it was just a dream. What's up? Lady Hilda is calling a meeting. Please go to the conference room. Okay, I just wish I could have dreamt a bit longer. Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. From Magi to Madu. Want to deliver a letter to Kamal. Thanks, Koopo. Save. Let's save, Koopo. Time for important meeting things. 